Hey everyone, Paul Gale Network here, and we are about to watch the PlayStation State of Play. This morning we had our Nintendo Direct, which was awesome, and now let's see what Sony's got. We'll have some indies, we'll have some third-party stuff. Should be cool. Kind of a funny, interesting start. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Kind of funny. Oh, don't fall off. All right. Oh, yeah. Post. Post. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Tree. Yeah. Oh. Oh, God. Mike, are you okay? Oh. You look sad. Oh, hey, Mike. No, 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 no. That's sad. I was just taking a break from my run. So road's out. Yeah, road's out, but no worries. Grapple point. Uh, oh, grapple see? point. Oh, I'll just grapple. I'll grapple it. Yeah, just grapple it with a grappling hook. Oh, yeah, I'll just grapple that fucker with my grappling hook. <laughs> yeah, no worries. Just grapple that fucker. I'll just grapple <laughs> that fucker. Yeah, good. All right. Well, Salada. Oh, Salada. Uh, yeah. yeah, all right. Let me pull out my grappling hook. Uh, I don't know where, Mike. Oh, oh, this is bad. Okay, all right. Okay, this is good. Oh, oh, no. oh, no. Okay, that's pretty legit. Baby steps. That's funny. Okay, I'll Hi, always try Benson. that out. Here at PlayStation, our team is always on the lookout for creative, inspiring, and original games to bring to PlayStation players around the world. We are constantly canvassing game development studios as we search for the next exciting idea. And as you just saw, Baby Steps is a great example of the innovative spirit that we're looking for. In today's state of play, we've got a wide variety of games to share with you. My hope is that these demonstrate the diversity of experiences coming to PlayStation consoles and PSVR 2. On that note, I'm very excited to welcome PlayStation players to Roblox. This infinite variety of 3D immersive experiences is making the jump to PS4 on October 10th. Roblox features full cross-platform support, so you can join 66 million daily active users across PC, mobile, and other platforms. We can't wait for you to explore millions of experiences together and to see what you create. All right, let's dive in. Starting with a look at two great games coming to PlayStation VR 2. Welcome cool. to the Ghostbusters. Oh, we like might Ghostbusters. be new here, but we have a job to get done. The city isn't going to save itself. So get geared up and join the team, because working together, go, go, go. We'll give you the best chance. We got this. Luckily, you'll have access to the latest ghost-busting gadgets, if you can earn them. We're talking turrets, shields, decoys, and so much more. Throw your trap. Whoa! Tie them up. I'm picking up something. Whoa! Watch out. You'll need to be ready for anything. Here we come! Before you'll be ready to take on the ghost lord. <laughs> Ghostbusters, rise of the Ghost Lord. Oh yeah, and these guys, mini puffs, they can be a real pain in the. 
Mm. Right in time for Halloween. Nice. No fucking way. Capcom's been on a roll for the last several years, just from Monster Hunter World to Monster Hunter Rise, Street Fighter V, Street Fighter VI, Resident Evil 2, 3, 4 remakes. Think you can swallow me whole, huh? Mm -hmm. Resident Evil 7 and 8, The Village. Cool. Yeah. RE4 in VR. The remake in VR, I should say. That was good. This is Gondor 1. The president's daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. I'm seeing increased movement from Los Illuminados. Don't get careless. Copy. Data 1. Data out. What terrible actions will be done in its name? And who will pay its dark cost? Find Lewis. Fetch me the amber. Have you changed, Ada? Or are you just trying to use me again? Because in this world, someone always pays. There's someone who needs me. Best not to ask who or why. What I researched for all these years, Ada. And I see the symptoms already showing in your eyes. Mm. Separate ways in one week. Yeah. Mercenaries free update also in one week. Speaking of Capcom, I wouldn't mind a Street Fighter VI Akuma trailer. Oh. We haven't seen Avatar in a little while. I am not me. No. You are what I made you! I was abducted by the RDA and trained in their ways. For 15 years, they kept me from my world and my people. Wait. You have the mark. You are Sorrento. The poor child knows nothing of our ways. Let Home Tree be a refuge from your burdens. I must seek those who can teach me the ways of the Na'vi. And help me reconnect with my world. Quite a colorful world. Hopefully the gameplay is fun. Jeez, because it looks gorgeous. You are starting to think like a Nazi. Now, we will teach you to ride like one. Now Pandora is under attack again. This land. This is my home. The Nav, the Nav, you will fight on your side against the RDA. I am Navi, and I will protect Pandora. Sivako! Promising. We need him, Connor. We need him stronger. Faster. Better equipped. More 
vicious than ever. We need him ready. I like the music. Colors. The dual sense is a nice controller. I do like it quite a bit. most likely. Oh, it looks nice. But if they show it off like anything, I mean I guess that's something. New colors, okay. Hi, I'm Yuan Bielestad, CEO and I don't mean anything director like, at Arrowhead Game you know, Studio. And today but I'm pleased to share an extended look at Helldivers 2. Slim, maybe. We're starting on the ship's bridge, preparing to select our mission from the, the Galactic console. War map. Still pretty, Once cleared though. for mission engagement, it's time to go into your hell pod and prepare for planet fall. Today, we join a squad on one of the many planets in the galaxy, set on an important mission to eliminate a deadly bile titan. Okay, we need to find the terminate bile titan. Uh, I think it's this way. There are some enemies here. Okay, I'm covering you on the right. We're covering your rear. Oh, there's loads of them. I'm switching to flame for Oh, oh god, there! Oh, it's the boss item! Oh, I died. Reinforcing. Oof, after run. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. Can you guys? Take him out with the recoilers. Yeah, I'll try to take him down from the side. Reload my uh, recoilers. On it. Oh, I got enemies on my back as well. Oh, there's a charger here. I'm gonna take out the brute commander. He's he's charging me. We take out the charger with the recoilers. All right. Reload me. Nice. I'm gonna thin out the crowd a little bit. There are a lot of them coming. My guard dog is taking care of the little ones. Oh, oh! I'm throwing out the strafing run to try to take out the small guys. Uh, oh no, you killed me! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> One small death for the hell divers. Reinforcing. Okay, should we do something? Should we strategize? I'm, I'm drawing his attention. Alright, I don't think I have an option. We need to throw in the 500 kilogram bomb. I'm throwing it out. Oh god, uh, he's coming for me. Getting out of the way. There okay, we go. there Good we go. Good job. Nice. Good job, guys. Well done, Helldivers. Another win for Super Earth. After each successful mission, players are rewarded for their efforts, allowing them to upgrade their ship, weapons, armor, and stratagems, giving them the edge in the many battles to come. I hope you enjoyed seeing a glimpse of just one of the many missions and planets the game has to offer. Now go out there and spread managed democracy. Pretty cool co op game. Hell Divers 2. But we're next year. Early in the year, giving people something to play with. That's good. Mm, I am looking forward to Spider Man big time. Gosh. Oh my gosh. This is Brian Intahar, senior creator hey, of Insomniac Games. Thank <coughs> you for all of your amazing feedback to our demo at the showcase earlier this year. 
Marvel Spider-Man 2 is filled with an amazing story and story missions. But today I'm here to provide you with a first look at how the open world experience is evolving and how the game is built to take full advantage of the PlayStation 5. The first thing you'll notice is that our city has nearly doubled in size with the addition of two iconic New York boroughs, Queens and Brooklyn. And we've introduced the web wings, an entirely new mechanic that, when combined with web swinging, allows you to traverse the city in a whole new way and at faster speeds than ever before. Whether it's a neighborhood backdrop of Queens or the fireworks that light up the sky over Coney Island, exploring these areas will feel much different than the towering skyscrapers of Manhattan, while also delivering memorable locales like Peter Parker's old stomping grounds in Midtown High and Miles Morales' current place of learning, Brooklyn Visions Academy. Hey Miles, what's up? Speaking of our heroes, Marvel Spider-Man 2 will introduce the ability to switch between the two wall crawlers in the open world. And, awesome. thanks to the power of the PlayStation 5, you can make that switch almost instantly. Delivering a bigger city and playing as not one, but two spider heroes were big goals for Marvel Spider-Man 2. But this time around, it was equally important to provide a greater sense of exploration and discovery. As you progress through the main story, a number of new activities and storylines will become available. The majority of those will now be represented by visual cues in the world that grab your attention such as a flock of Craven's Talon drones circling a building, a mysterious symbol projected into the sky, or even an unfamiliar spider bot ping emitting from one of the rooftops. Many activities, like the hunter's cloaked blinds that overlook the Big Apple, lead to even greater challenges, yet yield worthy rewards and new information about Marvel's greatest hunter, Craven. Others will lead to a climactic showdown with Marvel villains not yet seen in the Spider-Man universe. Wow. The spider heroes have new AR tech in the lenses of their masks, providing a quick glimpse of activities already discovered or helping locate new ones yet to be revealed. You can always refer to the upgraded Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man app to quickly track nearby areas of interest. The app will also include incoming requests from those who call Marvel's New York home. Some will ask for either spider hero to help, while others, like the students of Brooklyn Visions calling upon Miles, will require you to put on the mask of a specific hero. All these activities, including crime to stop from the game's various enemy factions, also now feed into the new District Progress system which even provides more rewards and unlocks our brand new fast travel system. As you can see here, it. the PlayStation 5 and its SSD means you can move across the city with very little downtime. Mm. Finally, the more city you explore and the more activities you complete, the more ways you'll be able to customize your spider hero. This includes mastering additional combat abilities and traversal skills, acquiring and improving gadgets, upgrading through the new suit tech system, and of course, unlocking additional spider suits. And we're talking lots and lots of suits. Marvel Spider-Man 2 will feature over 65 suits from the Jeez. comics, movies, and multiple original designs. And thanks to the all-new suit style system, you'll now have more than 200 different ways to outfit your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. No skimp in our of Insomniac oh. Games, we couldn't be more excited about what this expanded city has to offer and all the new ways you'll experience Marvel's New York. We look forward to seeing you swinging around in Marvel Spider-Man 2 when it launches October 20th, only on PlayStation 5. Spider-Man 2 is gonna be so good. I know it's going to be one of my serious <laughs> contenders for Game of the Year. I love the first one. I love Miles Morales. Venom is an awesome villain. I'm not stoked for that. And Wolverine. Without knowing anything else, really? Give me some Wolverine. One year has passed since the end of the Great Conflict. Between Dana and Rena. And so, our journey continues. There she is! Don't let her get away! After her! The gang's all here. The hell she did! She's a monster! The truth is that people will always doubt, hate, and reject. All differences must be erased. Once there are no differences, there will be... Two months? All right.
I'm glad that this presentation has what we call destiny a few games is that are neither visible very nor tangible. Near. Yet it is as certain I, as the collapsing and converging of the past out. and present. I called out to you and you came. The future is like a labyrinth. Every divergence is merely an inducement. There is only one real path. You and I are each other's destiny. Hey, Beth Vegas! Having a great time? I hope you're all ready for the Foam Stars Open Beta Party! Foam Stars looks pretty fun. The Fantastic Four versus Obviously four inspired by Splatoon, but different enough that it'll hold its own. Use Foam and knock out the opposition! Two insanely fun game modes! Smash the star! Defeat the star player to win! Happy Bath Survival! Dominate the arena in teams of two with support from your allies on the outside! Eight unique characters hit the stage! Soa! Agito! Tonix! Jet Justice! Melty! The Baristador! Raid Breaker! Penguin! We'll see you at the Foam Stars Open Beta Party! I'll give it a shot. We've been having a blast with Foam Stars, and we can't wait for you to get your hands on it. The open beta kicks off later this month. Before we wrap up, Square Enix has one more update for us today. Mm. They're hard at work on Final Fantasy VII All Remake, right. the ambitious follow-up to the critically acclaimed Final Fantasy VII Remake. Let's see what's in store for one of next year's most anticipated games. Oh, yeah. The world's ending. At least... That's what everyone's saying. The sky... I don't like it. Ready to fire, sir. Welcome... to the New World Order. Fire! Just close your eyes and listen. Tell me you can't hear that. Her rallying cry. The planet runs out of energy. It and everything on it. Dies. We can overcome our fate. Am I the same as these monsters? Am I even human? Okay, we're looking for Sephiroth. Think you can find him? Oh, Sephiroth, you see. So you heeded the call too, did you? What are you talking about? As you can see, your brothers down there are having a little get together. They're our best chance of finding Sephiroth. Yeah, I ask because I suspect they're soldiers suffering from cellular degradation. Do not be deceived. You know the truth. Trust in me. Sephiroth! Come on! Looks really polished. Excuse 
me. Could you look after my friend? <laughs> Just for a bit. A weapon? Tutelary creatures. Set only to appear when the planet is in grave danger. Who dares disturb my slumber? It's upon us. The reunion. When worlds merge. I'm waiting, Cloud. February 29th. Yeah, on two discs. Dang, that's a throwback right there. Jeez. We hope you enjoyed that new look at Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. It's coming to PlayStation 5 on February 29th. And that's all for State of Play. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. All right. Solid half hour State of Play. I mean, Insomniac games, they've been such a good part of PlayStation 5 being an early success, in my opinion. You know, Spider-Man, Miles Morales, kind of, I mean, being a cross-gen title on PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5 was a smart move. I played it on PS5 at launch. It was wonderful. I happen to really like Ratchet and Clank ripped apart, maybe more than most people that I've talked to, but it's a really good game. I don't think many people would argue otherwise, but I thought it was a great game. I really enjoyed it. And then, of course, the you know, remastered version of Spider-Man, and then now Spider-Man 2, and we already know that Wolverine is on the way. In fact, recently we learned that you know, some team members have officially moved on. At least publicly stating, moved on to Spider or to Wolverine. Yeah, they're like the MVP of this console. That's it. One last little look. Pre-order now. Get the 19 inches of venom. That was cool. Uh, nothing that completely shocked me. I don't think. Uh, let's see. We'll find a spot to pause it on, maybe. Cloud. Miser Spider Hero. Okay. Ah, Spider Man. Fitting. We just talked about Spider Man. Okay. So, yeah, like nothing super groundbreaking. Mm. I don't know what I was expecting necessarily. That's actually what I was expecting. Uh, maybe, like, my one little hope was, like, okay, some, some new footage from Street Fighter 6, Akuma, just because I'm a giant uh, Street Fighter guy and I love SF6. So, Akuma footage would be cool but you know we just got Aki so maybe that's a little bit too early and that's okay I wasn't expecting Wolverine today I did think we'd probably see some Spider-Man 2 we got that that was obvious Final Fantasy 7 uh, that seemed like a logical choice as well but overall good you know a nice little flow of some games coming out in the last quarter of this year and early 2024 pretty cool presentation Thank you for watching with me. This is Paul Gale Network signing out. Uh, what did you think? And if you watched this and the Nintendo Direct, did you enjoy this one more or that one or neither or both equally for just, you know, different reasons? But yeah. All right. Take it easy, everyone. See you next time. Bye.